Hi everyone, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com. We did it, we knocked out our Jaspie six box quick hit basketball mixer. Big, th big thanks to nobody, huh? So eager to start this break, I didn't fill in all of my lists here. Big thanks to, wait for it, this group right here. Congrats to the people who won spots and those two fillers that we did. Thanks to the people who bought spots straight up. And thanks to the teams, all 30 teams are in, no combos. And let's roll it, randomize names and teams, four and a five, nine times each. Two, three. Eight, and ninth and final time. Man, didn't even set up the, the spreadsheet either there. Just so eager to get into this break. Nine times for the teams. And ninth and final time, we got the Bucks down to the Clippers. All right, so Daniel, you have the Bucks and the Suns, Steve Birch, Raptors and Magic, Daniel with the Nets, David with the Heat, Ben with the Kings, Justin with the Thunder, David with the Bulls, Stephen K with the Hornets, Connor with the Rockets, Kennard with the uh, Nuggets, Daniel with the Pistons and Pelicans, Jackie with the Celtics, Brandon with the Grizz, Tim with the Knicks, Connor with the Jazz, Oliver with the Pacers, Justin with the Cavs, Devin with the Mavs, Daniel with the T-Wolves and the Warriors, Justin with the Wizards, Connor with the Trailblazers, Devin with the Spurs, Nick with the Sixers, Josh with the Lakers, Steve Birch with the Hawks, and Joe with the Clippers. All right, let's alphabetize by team. We're going to pause the video. When we come back, we're going to see if there's any trades, and then we'll have the break. Stick around. We'll be right back. All right, welcome back, everybody. We got a deal done. Oliver is out of the Pacers spot into the Celtics spot. And Jackie, out of the Celtic spot into the Pacers spot. All right, let's see who draws first blood, if any, in this trade. TWC trade window closed. Let's print and rip and see what happens. Yeah, I like the boldness. Jackie, I like it. There it is. We'll put T next to, next to your uh, teams there so you know that that was part of a trade. Excuse me for the sniffliness and the allergies are driving me crazy tonight. All right, uh, let's start with this hybrid box right here. This is 21-22. There's a couple different years here, so we'll bounce around a little bit. So we're, what, what three quarters away through the basketball season The All-Star break is not halfway through the basketball season like most people think. It's actually like two-thirds, three-quarters of the way through the season. So we only have, what, 20-some-odd games left. There's a Jalen Brown to 49. That's Oliver and the Celtics. I think Kevin Love's going to get bought out, and he's going to go to, what, He's going to go to Miami, I think. Russell Westbrook contract. His contract might get bought out. He'll probably end up in back in Los. He's going to stay in Los Angeles, actually. I think he's going to go to the. Uh, he's going to go to the Clippers. So now we're going to do twenty-one, twenty-two mosaic basketball.
And let's refresh our memories here on the standings. In the East, Celtics are leading the East by half a game ahead of the Bucks. And then Sixers, Cavs are behind those two teams. Nets, Knicks are the top six. And the current play-in spots are Miami, Atlanta, Wizards, and Raptors. With the Bulls and the Pacers kind of a what couple games, two, two and a half games out of a play-in spot. In the West, at Jackie saying Nuggets winning it all, and the Nuggets are five games ahead of the Grizzlies in the West. They're, they're quietly playing some, uh, I feel like they just don't get a lot of attention. They're playing some great basketball. But Nuggets are five games ahead of the Grizz. And it's Grizz, Kings, LA Clippers, Suns, Mavs in the top six. Your play-in teams are the Pelicans, T-Wolves, Warriors, and Thunder. And then Jazz and the Trailblazers are on the outside looking in. They're just a half game be ha behind a play-in spot. Uh, my Lakers, they got work to do. They got a, a leapfrog a lot of teams, and they got a, they're 14 games back. They got to make up those two and leapfrog a bunch of teams. If they didn't have to leapfrog a bunch of teams, I feel like it would be a lot easier. The fact that they got a lot of teams ahead of them makes it kind of complicated. <laughs> So we'll see what happens. And we got a Duran Sharp, 2 out of 10. It's a sharp looking card for Daniel and the Brooklyn Nets. Love the low numbers in this. And we got a nice uh, Jalen Green NBA debut rookie card for Connor and the Rockets. LeBron's a joke, Ryan Dix is saying. How so? Guy's having a pretty amazing season. And has had an amazing career. There's a Cade Cunningham National Pride card for Detroit. Rui's going to be a nice defense. I, I hope so. I mean, I, f I, I wish, wish those moves were made like, you know, a month or so ago before the trade deadline, but it is what it is. At least they made those moves. They finally, it just finally, I don't know. That's, I don't know if it's a championship team, probably not, but, but at least it's going to be a competitive team, which is what I like about it. It's actually, a watchable basketball. There's National Pride Jalen Green for Connor. And the autograph is Joachim Noah for the Chicago Bulls. That's for David. Thomas Bryant was the Lakers' best player. He did have a great run. His defense is a little something left to be desired defensively. But he did look pretty good, especially when Anthony Davis was down. But didn't want to see him go. Scotty Barnes for the Raptors. That's going to be for Steve Birch. Nikola Jokic. He's pretty good. He might win another MVP this year. Cameron Thomas going off.
I can't play in games with the Lakers, sore everything, but can play in the All-Star. Yeah. I mean, I don't know if that joke is a little bit, a little harsh. But I would have rather seen him not maybe play some regular season games and not play the All-Star game. Yeah, he got injured in the All-Star game, too. Eyebrows were raised. I don't think he's a joke, but it was, it was a little annoying. All right, just a couple cards in here, and hey, look at that. Three out of eight, R.J. Barrett. Rookie card for the Knicks. Tim with the Knicks. Nice. And we got a Brandon Clark rookie card also to eight. Hey, two rookie cards? I don't mind that. Brandon Jensen with the Grizz. Got the Grizzlies with the spot that he won in the filler. Loaders. All right, let's go back in time to 2017 Chronicles. Got a JJ Redick to 99. That's for the Sixers. That's for Nick. And we got a Donovan Mitchell. Jersey and autograph. Rookies offense steals the show. Nice. That's awesome. That's for Connor and the Jazz. There you go, Connor. Nice Donovan Mitchell, man. What a season he's having in Cleveland, right? That's pretty awesome. There's OG Anaobi, rookie card for the Raptors to 199. I didn't like how these were landscape mode that year. It's hard to hard to kind of break and show the cards. There's clay to two ninety nine. What's up, Diego? Uh, yeah, I might I might watch a little bit. And for the Magic, Wesley Uundu, one twenty five out of one forty nine. It's on the CW network, I think. The Live Tournament. But a lot of potential, Josh Jackson, but not quite. Yeah, I'll try to catch a bit of it. It was on Obi, Tony Parker to 199, and Derek White to 199, who's playing well with the Celtics now, I think. This is still Spurs edition. This is for... For Devin. I'm more interested though, Diego, in, I know you, you asked the other night and I forgot to answer it, but I'm a little, a little more interested in seeing the Mandalorian. Lori Markin in rookie card to 199. Bulls, David. Markel Fultz. Brilliance rookie card, Mark Fultz for Steve Birch in Orlando. All right, we're getting towards the end already. Let's flash forward to 2020, 2021. Yeah, Laurie Markin, all-star Laurie Markin, right? So, like, I feel like his first year, he was kind of hobby hot, then cooled off for a little bit, then got moved around, and then... And then ended up having a really nicely, nice, nice 
here. Nice season here. All right, we got Jaden McDaniels to 49. Timberwolves, D'Lo. We got a Kyle Lowry. And behind Dehunta Murray, which is numbered, is an RJ Hampton, which is also numbered. And we've got Moonlight Signatures Black, Isaac Okoro, rookie autograph, 3 out of 25. Who's got the Cavs? Justin does. Cleveland, this is for you. Isaac Okoro is for you. Nice. RJ Hampton goes to the Magic. That'll be for uh, Steve Birch in Orlando. To Hunter Murray to 149 for San Antonio. That's going to go to Devin. And the Kyle Lowry is numbered. I missed that. 19 out of uh, 65 right there. That's going to go to Toronto. That'll be for Steve Birch. All right. Sixth and final box. We flash forward to 21-22, Donruss Optic Basketball Choice Edition. That's right, Diego. It's Pedro Pascal's world. We're just living in it. What a year for him, right? I still haven't watched that HBO show. Rex, what's going on? How are you? All right. So what do we got here? Oh, okay. All right. All right. Hey, how about, some, how about a rated rookie hollow, Chris Duarte? It's going to go to Jackie and the Pacers. Pacers having a pretty solid season. Hey, this guy's having a solid season. Alperin Sengun. Rockets. It's for Connor. Then we got Denny Avija. Tim Hardaway. And look at this. Look what's coming up here. Tim Hardaway to 88. Yeah, this is out of Donner's Optic Choice. First of all, there's Greg Brown. And look at Evan Mobley. Rated rookie red Evan Mobley out of Donner's Optic Choice. Going to Justin Weber with a spot he bought straight up. <laughs> Cleveland, this is for you. There you go, gang. I'm Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com, and that was our Jazby Six Box Quick Hit Basketball Mixer uh, Random Team Break. Thanks for watching. Thanks for breaking with us. I will see you next time for the next one. Bye-bye.